Welcome back everyone. Today we are heading into Zangamarsh. We finished off Hellfire Peninsula in the last episode and we collected our first set of quests so we need to get started. We haven't done anything here yet apart from quest up, pick quests up. So we're going to go down here. We're going to go and kill Boglash. We're going to go down there and defeat the Umbra Fen tribe and then we're going to just see. We might work around this way unless it sends us up that way and then we're going to go do whatever it needs doing. Right, so, so... It says we got mail, but I think that that is still from the auction house. It is. We got 21 days left on some of the stuff that we were doing. Right, so let's just jump on this. We're going to go straight down and speak to... Do we need to empty our bags? Oh, we do. Let's just land on here. Land on here first. I'll empty my bags and then we'll head on down. Okay, we are good to go. So, hide the bag so we can see what we're doing. So, we need Boglash. We need Boglash. I know he's a big one of these, but I don't remember... It's been a long time. It's been a long time. There he is. Look at the size of him. We're going to jump down. I'm not sure if back in the day these were all elites or if they were all just like... Um, or if they were all just rare mobs. I can't remember it. You know, it has been so long. But I want to thank everyone who keeps coming back and watching. It really does mean a lot. Hope you are enjoying this area so far. Hopefully, I know, I've started doing a few little live streams as well. What I was planning to do tonight. Well, oh, what was that? <laughs> it was just his legs. What I'm planning on doing tonight is starting off the Mr. Pandaria remix. And hang on, we're going to go and hand this one back in. Because I've got a feeling that this is going to give us another quest. I'm not sure though. It might just be like a once a quest. So yeah, I'm looking at doing the Mr. Pandaria remix. And I'm going to do that on stream. So hopefully tonight is when I can start doing that. I was planning on doing it last night. But you know what? I was so tired. We, I took the kids to play tennis. And... When I got home last night, I was knackered. I'm a little bit unfit, you know. <laughs> but, you know, I'll be better tonight. We're going to the gym or something later, but I'll be all right tonight. I had a bit more of a sleep last night. So, you know. So, yeah, thank you, everyone, for coming in. Um, If you are new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. It really does help out a lot. I'm kind of at a point where, with YouTube, no, because I've been changing games and stuff, kind of at a point with YouTube where it seems to not know who to be sending me videos to. Which I did expect, I did expect, and it's just the way it goes. So now I'm kind of looking for a new audience compared to what I had before. I need to get closer. Hit that subscribe button, hit the thumbs up, hit the like button. And yeah, drop some comments down below, let us know what you think. And we will see if we can have some fun playing this game. This guy's taking ages to kill. And he's got another little mate there, he's running away. He's not, he's not. He was trying to run away. Right, so how many of these have we got to kill? We need eight of these seers. We need... Oh, we need loads of these, you know. We need absolutely loads of them. Wrath. He's trying to cast Wrath on us. Okay. We just did nothing. <laughs> right, there's another seer over there. We'll go and kill him. I'm out of range. Yeah, yeah. Right. Oh, yeah, so... I've got this little button, right? No, they're like... It's like a little line, and then it's got a finger like that on it. And... It presses my rebuke button. And I've just got to remember. I've got to remember to press it there so I don't forget. Scroll up the sections. You know what? We're going to use that. Just because we can. Just gives us a little bit of extra armor, is it? Armor increased by three. It's not a lot. He's seeing us from miles away. There we go. We remember to do it. Remember to press it. <laughs> Right, these guys, right, they're not doing a lot of damage. The sea is everywhere, right? Well, where are the rest of them? We've only killed one oracle. Ah, uh, there's another oracle on our left. We'll go and kill him next. You've got funny, like, little groaning noise, these people. Right, you can't kill him. He was trying to heal then. He was trying to heal. Oh, wrong button, wrong button. That's what I meant to press. Right, there we go. We've killed a few now. So we've got five of the Seers and two of the Oracles. So we need... Ah, there's another Oracle there. Go and kill him in his own house. So that button, right, seems to do a nice little bit of damage. I don't know what it is again. But Templar Strike. Begin the Templar combo. Striking the target for 417 Radiant Damage. And I guess when you press it again, you finish the combo. We do not need any of them Marsh Fang Rippers. I'm sure we will at some point, just not yet. Is there anyone in these buildings? No one in that one. No one in that one. 
So we need to find six witch doctors and Kats where's Katsuru? I don't know. It'll probably light up when we get when we're near, when we're closer to killing it. But there's loads of guys here. We've got another oracle. We've got a few oracles and a few seers, so the other guys must be somewhere a little bit different. Oh god. Uh Shield of Vengeance. Just protect ourselves a little tiny bit. But we've got Oracles and Seers all attacking us. Right, he's dead as well. That one over there hasn't seen us though. Oh, we're rooted. Oh, there's a chest as well. We'll go and loot that. A silver bound treasure chest. Right, he's nearly gone. He was trying to do something. Right, let's go in here and get that first. Them fence striders are huge. Oh, look at that. We got a nice staff there, but it's bound on equip. Oh, do you know what? I want to make a priest. That'll come in nice and handy. I don't know. I'll probably end up selling it because I'll forget. But, you know, <laughs> it's nice to have for now. Just as a little weapon. Right, there was another one up there. Another oracle. Do we still need them? We do. We need one more oracle. And we need one more seer. So we'll kill you. Look at him. He's just froze stiff. <laughs> what are these people? Look at the teeth on him. Oops. Look at the teeth on him. He's gone. Okay, so. One seer. And we need to find a witch doctor's where today. We haven't seen a single witch doctor. I wonder if they're not here. Can they be anywhere else? No. They're going to be in a separate section, right? Right, there's a seer and an oracle. We need one seer, so we'll kill you. I'm out of range. Hopefully, your mates don't all come and see us. Right, come this way a little bit. Oh, he's rooted us. <laughs> we throw something at you instead. <laughs> right, there's a quest there. There's a quest in. In there, in there. We need to go in that one. But we still haven't seen any witch doctors. Where are they hiding out? Oh, he's got a totem on the floor. Kill it. Whoa! There we break that. Oh, this is a witch doctor. We didn't see him. That's another oracle. Right, we're going to see if we can get in here without that oracle seeing us. Oh, I missed. I forgot stuck underneath. <laughs> he's going to see us, isn't he? No, he hasn't. Who's this? Escape from Umberfem. You must help me get out of here. I was gathering herbs nearby when a handful of these little savages abducted me. I tried to fight them off, but there were too many of them. Help me return to the Cenarian refuge and away from these cruel wretches and the ma vile magic. Let's go, Kaira Longmane, from to the Cenarian refuge. That's miles away. Return to Yisiel Windsinger when you've completed the task. Well, we don't get anything good, but we're going to help you anyway. So we're going to kill you first. Just because you're there. Oh, she helps. Oh, look at that. She's got magic right and she just sat there and let them. There's another article. And there's another article. We need the witch doctors. We've got to find some witch doctors somewhere. That's all we need. Uh, Katsuru, obviously. Oh. Right, you are going to have to go because... You're going to end up seeing us anyway. And you dead. Right, I know on some escort quests in the past, right, you used to get so far and then a few of them would just spawn next to you and you'd have to fight them. Looks like we're not... There you go. There you go. <laughs> we knew they were coming. We knew they were coming. There's none behind us, though. Uh, number seven. That's the right one. When I'm pressing buttons that far along on my keyboard, right, I have to look because I, I missed them. <laughs> Come on. You ready? Let's keep moving. Well, I'm ready to keep moving, but you're just stood there like a weirdo. Come on, let's go. This is kind of far, though. We've got to get all the way up there. I reckon we're going to get some more on this bridge. Where are you going? I don't know. <laughs> She's just taking the long way. Uh, we don't want to see any of these uh, uh, umbra glow stingers just yet. But I think... I reckon we're going to get to somewhere by this light and stuff's going to come. Let's keep moving. We're not safe here. But we're moving. We're moving. See, it draws us into a little false sense of security. This. It makes us feel like we're all right. We're halfway there. Nearly. 
And we've only been attacked by one group. I wish you could just get on my mountain and I could ride you there faster, you know. Up, three seats. There's Boglash, he's back, he's back, we don't want to fight him. There we go, there's another group somewhere. Look how Grojan enemies ahead. There's only two of them and they're only little guys, we're fine. Right, one's dead. And the second one is going to follow any second now. Here we go, dead. We're almost to the refuge, let's go. Oh, <laughs> I bet that scared the shit out of him, didn't it? Look, we, it's that far away, right? We can't even see it. I think, unless that them lights are the refuge, I'm not sure. Oh, yeah, look. You can see the little buildings in the distance. Look, there's a, another little, like, uh, pergola over there. Let's try not to get any of these the big bees attacking us. Big bees with yellow tails. I think we're okay. I think we're okay. I, I doubt we get attacked this close to Cenarian Refuge. I doubt it. So we've still got to find another five witch doctors. Oh, look. I can see my fellow Jews from here. Thank you, Grojan. I'm sure his zeal will reward you for your actions. Okay. Let's go and hand this into your cereal in case she wants us to go and kill any more of them people. Because you know what it's like. You know what it's like. The, you get sent back and forward sometimes. What brings you here? Escape from one, my friend. Right, we can take... A weapon because it's worth more money and we got warden's hammer it got upgraded to a rare one but is that a it's only a one-handed weapon so we don't need it anyway right let's head back down it's like the third time we've been down here we haven't even, we've only finished one well we finished two quests we've helped him and we killed a big bog lash thing him bog lash he's dead so we need to find five witch doctors and the boss there's a witch doctor there Hopefully we can get a few like this that are separate from the rest. Dead. <laughs> oh, I came off oh, too early. That's the Oracle. That's the Seer. Alright, I've got a feeling, right, these witch doctors are gonna be like one per camp kind of thing. Oracle, Seer. What's this little place? That's a weird thing, isn't it? In the middle of nowhere. There's no one here. I'd have thought that might have been where the boss was, but guess not. Right, a seer. Another seer. We kind of got mixed up there. Oh, look, that's a big house. That's going to be where the boss guy is. That's a witch doctor in there. Okay, this is where we're going. We're going to go upstairs. I've got a feeling the guy that we need to kill is upstairs in here. So that's where we're heading. To the top of the tower. That one's dead. Oracle tried to run away. Okay. Oh, we got to 47. Let's spend our talent points. So, this is on our retribution side. Hi, Lord's Judgment. Looks like one we can do. Judgment duration is increased by three seconds. We'll take that. That's passive. Okay. Up we go. Oh, there's witch doctors in here as well. This is even better. Might mean a little bit less wandering around, just looking for stuff. He fell down the stairs. <laughs> Up we go. Right, there's Kat Kataru. And there's another witch doctor there. Right, we only need two more of these witch doctors. We've got to find one more when we get out of here. Kataru didn't see us, but let's... I was going to say let's destroy his totem, but he died anyway. Right, Kataru, I've got a feeling he's got to have some little magic spells in his back pocket. So we need to be ready with rebuke. We need to be ready with our stuns. He doesn't actually seem to be doing anything. He's just dying. There he goes. <laughs> oh, we got a ring. That's good, that. And we're also going to use the agility thing. Not that we need it, but right, which is our worst ring. We're going to swap it for a man. Uh, eight, three, five, six. We're going to change it for the blue one. The man in the signet. That one. Okay, we should be able to fly out of here. And we just got to look for one more witch doctor. Where would he be? Where would he be? 
Right, what the hell is that? Iron Spine Petrifier? We don't want to mess with you. Oh, oh God, we don't want this here. Let's leave this here alone. There's a... Oh, that. It's following us. It's proper magic, that. <laughs> it is us, I think. I think it is us. Right, there's another article underneath us, but we're going to land around here. We're going to see if we can pull that witch doctor across to us. Stun him a little bit. We don't want him to ping any of his mates. There's another one coming. Uh, he stopped, he stopped. He's just seen the witch doctor getting battered and he's thought, I'm not going over there. Let's head back, hand this in. And then we'll go and do 30 Naga Claws and Umbra Fen... Uh, do you know what? We're going to go and do that first. 30 Naga Claws and Umbra Fen Lake investigated. But that, I've got a feeling that Umbra Fen Lake is going to be somewhere else. I don't know whether it's going to be here. Or is this going to be Umbra Fen Lake? I'm not sure. Much easier when you can fly. Not going to be underwater. Oh, we've discovered Umbra Fen Lake. Do we need to go in there to discover it? Hang on, where is it? Umbra Fen Lake. Investigated. No, we haven't investigated it. There's all kinds here, though. Discovered Dark Crest Shore. Right, we might have to... Right, we're discovering Umbra Fen Lake, right? But do we need to go in it? I don't actually know. I don't think so. Look at them eels. Electric eels. Umbra Fen eels. I can't believe our bird can fly underwater. <laughs> Weird. <laughs> right, they've got a drag, dread, dread something. What's he called? Drag hood drudge. Right, we're just going to land here. And we're going to tackle you. Arcane bolts. These are like mages, these guys. Oh my god, a sword, you knows. You're dead. Right, we've got one claw. Oh, we only got one claw from him. Oh, we hit the little guy too. I mean that. I'm sorry. <laughs> Don't come and fight us. Right, we've got... We, there's quite a few on this island, to be honest. We might not take us that long. We only got one claw. We got an unidentified plant. Oh, we need on, we, we need them unidentified plant parts. We need 30 of them. I think we're just going to get them from killing things, aren't we? We don't need to worry about, like, where they're coming from. Okay. I would have liked to have thought there would have been some chests or something on the island, considering... Considering it's in the middle of nowhere. What was that bang, then? Oh, it's the one behind us shooting us. Uh, do you know what we need to do? We need to put our heel on a button so I don't have to click it. But where? You could do it like a macro and just do like shift and one or something to heal. Like, we're frozen. We're frozen. We're out. Like, that doesn't work. <laughs> oh well. We have to just wait until it lets us go. Until, come on, let us go. I pressed our button to let go, get us out. Oh, we got it. We got our blessing of freedom. I didn't think we had that yet. Oh, there's someone else there. Right, we've only got five of the Naga Claws. We still need another 25 of these. Kind of makes me wonder if we actually need to fight these or if we're just going to come along, come across them on other quests and have to kill them anyway. But you know what? We're going to do it anyway. What's that there? Dark Crest Sorceress. Well, there's a few people here. Right, we're going to have to stick our little shield on. Spinny down thing. Consecration. Oh, we've got loads of them. Right, one's dead. One's dead. Someone's... He's evading. He's running away. Oh, now you're not evading. Now you're coming back. You want a little piece. Yeah. I'm getting so much gold. I'm just trying to keep an eye out. There's a slaver at the back there. So it looks like the slavers are the ones that have got them little guys with them. That's a cloth item. Oh no, the slaver hasn't got no one with him. The sorceress has got a little, um... Oh, what are they called? Elemental. Sorceress has got an elemental with it. Right, there's ten done. I'm out of range. Come on, you. Right, where have we got to go to... To explore Umbra Fen Lake? I think that might just take us a little bit of time to find out that one. 
Mail pan, mail gloves. We don't need you. It looks like our damage is doing loads, right? When we're doing like 1,090, 1,100. But it really isn't. It's just, it just scales, isn't it? It doesn't really get you anywhere. Like disturbance at Umbra Fen Lake, we must have to find something. I'm wondering if that's where... Was it called the Steam Vaults? Was it called the Steam Vaults? There was a raid underwater, wasn't it? I'm wondering if that's where we got to discover. I remember when we used to die in there, right? And the walk back was so, so long. Right, there's no one else on this side. Right, we're going to try and dodge that little guy there. There we go. Two more. Hey, oh, more than two. I didn't see him. <laughs> he snuck up from behind. Right, so we kill these two. There's a loads of them everywhere, right? So it, it, we haven't really got to look for, <laughs> have we? Oh, there's another one there. We kill you first. Oh, sorceress. There's two guys there. I don't want both of them to come over. They're just digging away, though. I don't know whether they're going to fight us. What are they mining? It's like they're digging up mushrooms. Right, we'll fly back to that guy over there. That guy, that crest slaver. Well, no one came with him. Which is good. We've got all, like, the slaves digging stuff. More unidentified. That's only our second unidentified vampires. I need to get closer. I can uh, interrupt you from all the way over there. I right, saw so the source just didn't bring that thing. The Dark Crest Sentry. Didn't. How many have got? 18 out of 30. We're getting somewhere. It's taking a while, but we are getting somewhere. Right, there's nothing else on this side. Right, we've cleared all these over there. So, we have got to look for... A disturbance at Umbra Fen Lake, right? And that little thing has just been telling us to come over this side. This looks like where they might be digging. Or getting something out the water. So, is this where we're going? What the hell is... Am I a Hydra? Right, so this is the pumping water, or the pumping something from underneath. Right, Darkest Shore. Right, this is not where we're looking for then. Is it? <laughs> Let's see. So, that pipe that was going under the water, right? Stops there. Stops there, and I think it goes into that middle section. Oh, hang on. Disturbance from Brefair Lake. We've discovered it. We've discovered it. So, that's all. We've killed all the Naga there. Oh, but there's more islands. But they don't count. Right, we've got to go over to this side. I know there's a couple there, but there's not many. We need lots more. But we're going to go over to this little section. Unless that's where we've just been. I don't think it is. It's not. It's not. Right, who's that up there? That's a quest person. It's a quest person. So we're going to have to come back and kill you. Right, let's find another little group. There we go. I'm out of oh, I thought they weren't going to come. I thought they weren't going to come. I thought they were just going to stand there digging. So it doesn't matter though, because we can kill these easy enough. He's running away. Where did that We just shot one. Oh, there she is. She's not come with us. Right, interrupt the frost bolts. Oh, we've been silenced. We've been silenced. That doesn't even help us. Less than the freedom, will low. Oh, she's dead. She's dead. We got another unidentified uh, another unidentified plant part too. Okay. And another one. We got four out of ten. We didn't get any for ages. No, we just had two that quick. Why is the taskmaster not seeing us? Well, let's make sure he sees us. Oh, we can't reach yet. Are you dead? We got a jagger clam. Where did that go? We got three of them. We got some jagger clam meat. The taskmaster just come to see his own death. We got a darker siren over there and a taskmaster. We only need another eight of these. 
I'm out of range. We get you. Oh, we uh, we need another long range attack. Don't we just so we can pull more than one thing at a time. Would be handy. Fun. Let's get the last seven really quick. And we'll play with your little judge. Guy. Is he's dead? Or she's dead? He's running away. And now he's gone too. A little jaggle clamp. Right, I'm going to stick them on there just so we can unlock them, open them as they come. We got a jaggle pearl after. I mean, the pearls would probably come in quite handy if we were selling stuff, but we'd never go back to, like, storming. You know what? There must be. Hang on. I, I remember back in the day, like, was there a portal? Was there a portal to get us back and forth? I can't remember. I know when you were in uh, Dalaran, it was, but I don't remember how long when there was a portal place. Do you know what I think there was? When we go into Terraka, right? Isn't there a place there where you choose who you want to be, whether that's the... Oh, I forgot, I forgot what they're called. I'm sure there was something that you'd have to you choose sides. I can't remember which was which. But one side gives you... You got rep with one or the other, didn't you? Hey, right, Taskmaster. How many more? Three more. So Taskmaster, Siren, and another Taskmaster there. Hey, right, come on, you come over here. Another the plant part. And you're dead. Right, we just need the last one. We're going to take this side. In. And hopefully we can interrupt you before you cast your thing. We're going to take it out. My voice is going. <laughs> My voice is going. It's not good when you're trying to record video, is it? Right, that's done. We have finished all the quests. Oh, oh, we have got to kill that guy. I didn't know there was a quest to kill him. Otherwise, we would have done that before. But you know what? We're going to go and kill you two. Oh, uh, no, we get extra. We get extra. Well, that one over there hasn't seen us, so that's kind of good. And they're all gone. Two more plant parts, nice. Okay, so we're going to kill you. We're going to just stun you. Uh, we're going to use that. What's this one? Increase attack power by 72. I forgot all about that. <gasps> Didn't mean to press that button. Raja High Lord. High High Hags Hag Hazed. Right, he's dead anyway. That was quick. Right, let's go and hand these quests in. We have got four to put back. Okay, so we've got our first ones to hand in to Yseel Windsinger. Yseel Windsinger wants you to use the Stormcrow amulet to explore the major lakes in Zangamash, okay? I've got a feeling, right, that that's going to just fly us around. I'm not sure. I can't remember. Right, Lethrin Moonfire. Watch uh, Lisa. Oh. Goodbye. Speak with one of the druids at the Cenarian Thicket in Terracar Forest. We've still got more quests to hand in. One must be at the top of that tower. Yep. It's Warden Hamut. A warm welcome. Go in. 30 Naga Claws. We get volatile healing potions. We got Leader of the Dark Crest. The Expedition Mantle. We get some shoulders. Okay, so them shoulders are looking much better than what we've got. So we're going to put them on. They're kind of big, aren't they? It's like, uh, it's back in the 80s when everyone used to have the big shoulder pads on the blazers and stuff. And we've got another quest to pick up there from Ikian. Needs to be closer. How much closer? We're nearly touching them. Oh, we've just got... Did we level up then? 48. Level 48. Look for Ichian's belongings inside a cave south of Umbrafen. Return to Ichian at Cenarian Refuge in Zangamash. And saving the Sporlocks. Slay 10 marsh dredges, 10 marsh lurkers, and then return to Lorana Tharwell in the Cenarian Refuge. And there's another quest there. Wish to speak. Lessons of the Ancients. Windcaller Blackhoof wants you to speak to the Ancients Ashian and Keleth, a Cenarian refuge, and obtain their blessings. Right, safeguarding the Watchers. 
Killlaw Clack and return to Windcall of Blackhoof at the Sanadian Refuge. Hey, and I'm sure we've still got another quest. Yeah. Oh, we've got to go and speak to you. Grab me your mark. Why is ancient? Okay, so we have got. Uh, damage and healing done. And agility. But there's still another guy that we've got to go and speak to somewhere. There, Mark of War. Where did he go? It says he's here. Somewhere. Is that him? Kelleth? Ancients of War. Grab me your mark, mighty ancients. Here we go. So we have got... All primary stats have increased by 7 for half an hour. Right, so we're going to use them today. Oh, blessing of the ancients. We've got to go and hand that quest back into the guy over there. And he's going to ask us to do something, isn't he? What's That's going to require this extra power. Winds be at your back. Or maybe not. Oh, we've got a talent point to spend. Right, one on this side. Seal of mercy. Golden path strikes the lowest teeth. No. Uh, what do we want to do? What's this one? Heal on hands to cool down the lay on hands. Oh, no. We've done... We've already used that one. Blessing of sacrifice. What haven't we used? Did we use any of these up there? Turn evil. Or do we want a fear? No, we're going to take a fear. we we'll keep that up there. Right, so first off, we are going to go down to this cave. We're going to go and kill Lord Clack. We're going to go and get Ilkian's belongings. And we're going to go and kill 10 marsh dredges and 10 lurkers. So we need to head south. Uh, yeah, do you know what? We've had our Crusader order on as well. And I still keep forgetting it to change to that retribution order. What's this one? Interrupt and silence effects on party members within 40 yards of shorter. And we get devotion, reducing damage taken, which isn't a bad one to have either. Retribution seems best for me though. What's that say? When any par party or raid member within 40 yards takes more than 30% of their health in damage in a single hit, each member gains 5%. You know what? We probably want to use that one. I think. <laughs> I think. I think when you were in raids, if you had like four paladins, you just have one of each order on. That was the way that worked. Whoa, them marsh lakers are kind of big. Oh, we got a little sporlock that's fighting it. But oh, we're going to kill them anyway. Are we going to fight these sporlocks if we accidentally attack them? I don't know. I don't know. But that big guy is nearly dead. No, the sporlock isn't attacking us. That's even better. Even better. Oh, marsh lurker. I didn't see another way through in this cave then, but you know what? It's okay, because it's turned around the bend. He's a big airy guy, aren't he? It's, that's like moss, isn't it? Moss hanging down. We got some Zanga trout. Some fish. I'm out of range. I'm out of range. It's too far away. Uh, there's loads of these guys in here. Right, we've got to find his belongings. Uh, I wish it showed you like a little bit of a map inside so you could kind of see where you were going. we got another jaggle clam, though. This place is huge. Oh, hang on. What's that down there? Marsh Dredger. Should we just drop down? We're going to have to fight our way back up if we do. I think we're going to go after... I think we've got to go up and down, to be honest. It says we need his belongings, right? Lord Clack, he's going to be down the bottom, isn't he? We'll go up first and we'll see what's up here. Because it seems weird that there's a way up and a way down. There's so many of these things in here. I don't know, we're just gonna we're just gonna have to run around and look. Another unidentified plant parts and a clam. Right, we'll have a little look here. Oh, it nearly fell off the edge. Right, it doesn't look like there's any Oh, is there? There's loads of marsh there. Oh, there's no way across there. Okay, so we're going this way. I'm wondering if this is just gonna lead us down a different way, because it doesn't look like we're going up anymore. I don't know, we're going to be in here for ages. <laughs> Are we? We're going to be in here for so long. <laughs> Good job we got that bonus. We didn't get much money off you. Kind of we. Oh, them that dead people on the floor. It's them little guys that are fighting the spore people. And you're killing all the little plant guys. Why so aggressive? Right, what's this? Ghost mushroom requires herbalism. All right, well, yeah, I think we're going to be going down that way. Oh, there's Lord Clack. He's the big guy there that we got to kill. He's surrounded by loads of people, loads of mobs. All right, it's getting a little bit of a speed up coming. We kill both of you. I don't 
don't know where we're going in here. This place is massive. It's going to take us ages to find our way down. And then, then we've got to find our way out. This is where it would have been good to have a headstone set for the sound upstairs, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. I don't know whether there's a way through over there, but we're going to have a quick look. But we're just going to check over this side a minute. I'm flying here, which is a bit rubbish. Okay, so no, there's no way up over this side. So let's go down there. See where that takes us. It's cool, isn't it? The, way the graphics are still quite good in this. It is kind of cartoony, but it is overall really good. Right, we are heading down this way. We're going to try and skip that guy for now. Because it doesn't look like we need to fight all of them. And we'll get the big giant marsh lurker. I'm wondering if his belongings are down the bottom. Kind of makes sense. What's up this way? I don't know. I don't know. I, th I feel like this is the way to go. I might be wrong. I might be wrong. Is that a pathway? Uh, I think we should have went up. <laughs> I think we should have went up. <laughs> is there... Oh, there is a gap. There is a gap. Ah, uh, this is going to be the way. This is going to be the way. Oh, no, then. Well, we're just going to go and help these guys. We're just going to fight them all. Take our little shield on. Two of them just ran away from us. Oh, uh, now he's come back. Uh oh. Best in the freedom. Right, we'll stick our little, our little wings on. I don't know why. There was only one left by the time we got there. Right, is he's dead anyway. Ruin a healing potion. So that does... What does that do? Removes any... Oh, stun effects. That well, doesn't really affect us doing what we're doing. Right, there's Lord Clack. That's where we've got to get to. But we've still got to find this other guy's stuff. And I don't know where he's lost it. It is in here, right? right? Most of our stuff is going to be on cooldown by the time we come and fight all these. It is, it is. Well, this ain't good. I right, will use that one. Uh, that's still on cooldown. we still got light on hands if things go bad. We can... Give him a little bit of a stun. We are stunned too. We are stunned too. We could do with a little heal though. Just a little one. This is Lord Clack that we're fighting now. And that heals us too. For the size of him. Lord Clack is complete. Right, where's his stuff? A damp dark place. That looks like the entrance. Right, we still need some dredges. That's a lurker. We need to find. We've killed all. We've killed all the lurkers. We just need four more dredges. So we've got to find them on the way back up. Got a feeling they're going to be nearer the surface. Then, if we haven't seen them down here, we've got to be nearly nearer higher up. There's a dredger. So we just need four of you. Right, there's another one up here too. Yeah, that's perfect. Perfect. How rich are we now? How rich are we now? 3,395 gold. I hope his belongings aren't just somewhere that in here. Just like lying there that we can't, we're can't. we going to miss. Right, you're dead. We just need two more of you. And we got another jaggle clam meat. It's right, 260 yards or something that way. There's something that way. That must be his clothes. Right, there's another dredger. Good thing is, right, is we seem to be way, way overpowered for everything that we're doing, <laughs> don't we? <laughs> we're not really struggling with anything. That's the last dredger that we need. Although it looks like we're going to be killing more of them. I was worried that we weren't going to find enough, but you know what? We are. Easily. Right, we're going to try and get past you before... You kill that little guy and put us in combat. Look at that. There's the little spore guys that we saved. Oh, hang on. Ichian's belongings. Don't tell me that they're not outside. Are they going to be under the ground? Is there another place for them to be? There's no other little caves. Right, Ichian's belongings. Soon after I escaped the Umberfen tribe, I holed up in a cave south of their village. 
Little did I know that the cave was being fought over by marsh beasts and spawnmen. I had to leave in a hurry and left a box containing my worldly possessions after managing to speak out of Umbrafen with my belongings. It was a terrible irony that I'd lose them soon after. If you're willing to bring them back to me, I'll give you one of my very own personal items. What do you say? It is. It's inside that cave. It's inside that cave and we've got to go and find it. So we're looking for a box. But where? But where? Ah, uh, this is going to be a pain in the ass, this one. Because we've just killed most of these, right? And they're going to all respawn. Get a clamp. But we're looking for a box of stuff. Right, what I'm going to do is we're going to jump down. Just in case the box was down here. I wouldn't imagine that he'd have come down to see Lord Clack with his box of stuff, though. Would you? What do you think? I really want to fight all these again. If we can help it. I'm not seeing a box of stuff. Right. He's never seen us. But that's showing it's like near the entrance. Right, we're going to go back up this way. Uh, little Sporlock, have you seen a box of goodies on the floor anywhere? It's saying 72 yards this way. There's something there, there's something there. Behind him. That's it, there it is, we found it. Now we've got to find our way out though, without fighting too many of these guys. Hey, we got the clan meat. More Jagal clan meat. Jack, Jackal. Right, Ichin's belongings. Ikian, you've caused us so much trouble here. Can we get out of here in one piece? It's some of these are fighting stuff, so we might be okay getting past a few of these bits. Right, where was the exit though? I don't I forgot the way out. It's gonna be around this way. It's gonna be around this way. They're all fighting stuff, so if we're quick enough, if we're quick enough, we can't mount up, which is a pain. But we're going to see if we can not fight this guy. Because even if you kill that little guy there. This one, we've got no choice. We're going to have to fight you. If we'd have just found him belongings right on our way down, we'd have been done. We'd have been done and on our way back and safe. But no, we just had to skip it. We... <laughs> uh, uh, uh. He found us. I don't know where the exit is. <laughs> I'm lost. <laughs> right, we're rooted. You got some fish, though. I right, kill you. Right, we've only got 14 minutes left on this um, this thing. Right, it's got to be this way, right? Got to be this way. Looks like yeah, there's the exit. Finally, finally, we're out. So what level are we now? We're level 48. I'm guessing it's level 60 when we head to the new zone. But I don't even know how to get there. I don't even know how to get there. On one hand, I was sitting there thinking I should have done like Shadowlands or something because I haven't been there before. Or whatever the latest expansion is. But you know what? It's so long since we've been here. Since I've been here. And I thought, you know, let's go. Let's just go back and see what it's like. Has it changed? Have we gone through like a a time portal that brings us back to how it was back in the day or did we just get teleported here I don't know right so we got some quests to hand in we've got Windcaller Blackhoof that's that one Ikian what are you going to give us I hope you got something good in your bag you know oh you have your you've got refuge armor we're going to take that better than what we're wearing Hans of Zangamash Oh, we got all the unidentified plant parts. What did we just get then? We got a bag or something. Common Azerothonian. I don't know what they are. Sorrow moss and common fern. That's rubbish, that. Saving the Sporlocks. Right, we got a nice helmet. Oh, that has sockets in it as well. And it. Oh, we got an achievement part. Saving the Sporlocks. Right, that's just more unidentified plant parts. So, is that all the quests done in this little section? All right, let's head over to them. The bar, whatever that is. There's a flight master over there, though, so it's a good idea to get. 
So we have reached Telrador. Telrador, we need to find a little flight master. There's one somewhere because we did see him. Uh, where is he? This way, this way. Oh, he's higher up. He must be up. Up here. Oh, well, this goes high, doesn't it? <laughs> right. Mun Munsi. Right. Munsi. We spoke to Munsi. There's loads of quests in this part. So we're going to come and speak to Ankara. Ankarite. A who? The Orobor Harborage. To speak to Ikori at the Harborage in Zangamash. And Ankarite Telrador wants you to explore the Bo Boha Mu ruins. Remember the lesson. Respect the Colonel. Wants you to kill Sporewing, okay? Nice easy one. There's a quest here from Ruam. Bring six Fulgur Spores to Ruam. Safe journey. And there's a couple more on this side. May the light so many quests. Menace and Marshfangs. Kill ten Marshfang Rippers. Warm wishes and too many mouths to feed. Kill ten Maya Hydra. Right, is there any more quests here? There is, but it's lower down. Someone right down on the ground down here, possibly. Possibly. Oh, it's staying up now. Okay, so there's another floor. Is there? Oh, there. <laughs> it uh, Vindicator it uh, The dead Maya. Bring a dead Maya soil sample to Vindicator. And the fate of Tareem. Take vind Vindicator Idar's letter to Andal and take the Illyrian stronghold in Terechim. And at the. Well, yeah, Good whatever. <laughs> Right, I think that might be all the quests there. So, six Fulgur Spores. Let's go and get the Dead Maya Soil sample first. That's all the way over there. And then... We need to kill Spore Wings, so we'll do that on the way back. And then we'll go and kill... Oh, while we're there, we can kill ten Marsh Van Grippers. Okay. So we'll do all them. And then start heading back. So we need a Soil sample. The dead Maya, look how grim this place is. This is minzy. Someone looks like they've been sucking all the stuff out, the water out of you. So we need a soil sample. Where from? There's one. Right, that's that done. Doesn't look like we got any quests to kill any of these guys, but I'm guessing that we're going to. Right, so next we're going to go and kill Sporewing. Yeah, we're definitely have to, gonna have to go and kill some of them bog lords. Oh, there's Sporewing. Nice. <laughs> Came across him accidentally. Sporewing. So is he like the leader of the, the? What are they called? I don't know. You know what I do know though? He's dead. We killed him. Right, that's that one done. Marshfang, oh, there's a Marshfang Ripper. We need to kill loads of these. What's that? Rage something? It's a tailoring item. You know what? I'm wondering. I just want to go back to that dead area, right? Because I want to kill one of them big guys. Because I'm wondering if we get a quest off any of these. Because it seems the weird that there's loads of these withered bog lords and stuff. And with the giants over here. And we didn't have a quest to kill any of them. Unless... That sample goes back and then he sends it back over here. I'm not sure yet, but it's likely, isn't it? Bog Lord Tendril. Oh, I've got a feeling we might need some of them. What are they? Doesn't say, but there's got a sell price. So we're going to go and kill 10 Marsh Fang Rippers. If we can find them. Ben Strider, we don't need any of you. There's that one. I need to get close. Loads of them fence riders about. Marsh Van Gripper is dead. Right. These don't look that easy. To, they're, they're not like. They're not like. Um, looped up. So we're going to have to search for these a little bit. Drain mana. We don't tend to use that much mana, you know. But, uh, for a paladin. For a, oh, look at the lift going up. Marsh Van Gripper, come back. Right, you're gone. How many more of these do we need? Six more. That's not one. That's a, a young spore bat. It is no more here. No more here. We've killed all them. But there's one. These things don't seem that bad, you know. All right. I mean, they're like flying fish, but... 
but not like it's not like you go and get like a little colony of ants and they're everywhere cockroaches and stuff they're just there uh, minding their own business eating bugs and shit oh what's that oh we need these gotta keep our eye out for them little green things I need to get but well, we can fly around and look for them. We'll find them pretty quick, I think. Hey, you're gone. There's another one. I don't have a target. I haven't seen any more of them green things though. But we'll get you. Oh, we've leveled up. We only need two more of these. Let's use our talent point first. So we need to spend one more. Vanguard adjust us your damaging holy power abilities. Cost one additional holy power and deal 20% more damage. Why not? I know. Now we have unlocked the bottom section. Okay, we're going to kill you. And then we just got to find one more of your friends. Okay. What's that over there? It's a herb. We don't need to worry about that one. So one more Marsh Fang River. We keep getting loads of them on unidentified plant parts, right? And I'm sure it was a repeatable quest. I'm sure it was. Right, we're going to look for these green things first because where does it say they are? Raja's fashy. We've got to slay someone. Full gold spores. Oh, there you are. All right, do you know what? Do we need to kill any of you? No. We will go and kill that last one that we just seen. If we can find them again. Because it's too I think we're going to find all them green things on the floor around the tower that we just come from. The noises in this zone are creepy, you know. So, full gold spores. Let's go and find them. Oh, hang on. What's here? Oh, hello. So, you've got to kill you. <laughs> is she immune to something or was that us immune to something? I don't actually know. But we'll stun you anyway. Just stop your cause and trouble. Right, we haven't got to kill any of these. We've done loads of these quests, you know. Loads of them. Alliance Field Scout. Who's that? Oh no. Oh no. So where are these green things? It says we're in the right area. Okay, we found another one. It's under the water though. Oh, it's in the water, but we can stand up and then it's not deep. So we've just got to find another four more of these fungal, fungal spores. And it seems like they're just scattered around below us. So, nice and easy to find, hopefully. We need three more, I think. Yeah, three more. There's one. Right next to a Marsh Fang Ripper. Right, I think we're okay. There's another one there. Can we get you without it's aggro on that? Away. Yes, we can. Nice. So we just need one more of these. One more. I'm not seeing any though. We're out of the... I think we're out of the area. We are. We've gone too far away. Gonna just be in the water, I bet you. Oh, hello. <laughs> Didn't see him coming. He spawned in quite late. There it is. There it is. And we'll go and hand in everything here we've got. We've done absolutely loads of quests. We've got to go and do them hydras. And we've got to go back and speak to someone all the way down there. But let's hand all these quests in first anyway. So we'll fly to the top. We'll speak to you first. Narani. Menacing Marsh Fangs. 22 gold. Wow. Bring it. Eight eel fillets. Eight eel fillets. Hey, we've got someone on this side. Ruan. Fungal spores. Remember the lessons of the there was someone else just here. Prospector. To meet you. Choose your reward. Right, we want to do strength probably, don't we? Watch and imagine, back. I don't actually know. Bring Black Still Stinger to Prospector someone. Hey, we got... Oh, we got five of them. Oh, we just put it on you. <laughs> oh, well. Prospect is stronger. Uh, where's this quest? There's another one. There, there, there. Vindicator Idar. Soil sample. Kill 12 with the giants. Final surge. Quest complete. What's that? Complete your traveler's activities each month to earn a tender and special reward. In your collector's cash. Oh, okay. So, complete dragonflight dungeons. 
complete world quest. Oh, there's loads of stuff there. All right, well, we're not doing a lot of that stuff yet. Anyway, right, quests. We need to go and hand one back into Scenarian Refuge. We've got to go back up to the Dead Mire and kill loads of stuff there. So, we're going to fly down this way. Sort that one. And, and then, what time is it? We've been going for an hour. Should we just... Um, we keep the episodes a little... Let's go and do the Dead Mire, right? We'll go and do the Dead Mire. Then we'll go and hand that quest in a Scenarian Refuge. Then we'll go and hand this one in. We'll do them too. And then hand them in a Telra door. And then we'll finish off the day. I don't want to keep you going too long, you know. Right, so we need to kill... Was it 10 of these with... 12 of these with the giants? There's one. I'm out of range. He's still making noise. <laughs> right, these hydras, they're parched hydras. They're not the ones we need. We do need hydras, but not them ones. Oh, well, we shot him from miles away. Let's put our little shield on just to... Just because we can. Right, there's one dead. What's that thing on the floor he's doing? There's like a blue spinning thing around us. We just got moat of life. I remember, right, them moats. You used to get like 10 moats, didn't you? And then you'd make it into something else. And I remember, like, when I was doing me tailor and all blacksmithing i can't remember we had to use loads we had to farm loads of them it was so important to, back in the day for creating gear but when you used to get to like level 70 and you could craft your own like your little it was like a, it was like raid gear but it wasn't i mean it was like your pre-raid gear but it was your first epics and do you know what Dungeons and stuff were quite hard in this expansion. Like, you could do raids before you could do some of the heroics. It was mad. It was good, though. It was good that there was, like, a progression of back and forth to do stuff. And it kept you busy as well. It meant, like, you'd be doing a few raids, and then you'd come back and be, be able to battle your way through dungeons, but they were quite hard. And then Wrath of the Lich King came, and dungeons were, like, five-minute jobs where everyone just sped through them, and it, it was weird. In a way, it's good that you're not spending an hour, two hours in a dungeon. But, oh, with the Bastidium. Take the with the Bastidium to Telrador, okay. Oh, hello. Ah, oh, didn't want to fight you. We might have to. To collect something else. Who knows? But you died really fast. Clan. Oh, hang on, what's this? Oh, we've still got to do that. We're all about that one. We've got to uh, explore places, haven't we? As a bird, by the sounds of it. Right, that's that one. How many more? Five more. So we can see more than five just where we are. It's a little red snake. It's a pet. We can catch that. 19. What did we hit then? I don't know. <laughs> did you hear them? This one, and then two more. Oh, three more, because he didn't count. He'd already died. Hey, nice and quick. You know what? If I'm pressing the right buttons, things do die kind of quick. That's just when I'm... Just... Is that like a snake over there? Look. It is. It's like a snake. Osmosis. What is osmosis? Is that healing? Right, this is going to be our last one. The very last one. We go. Dead. Okay. So, we're going to go to Scenarian Refuge. I'm sure we've got to do that flying quest down there as well. The wrong way. I'm sure we got a flying type quest down there. Blades Edge Mountains. Do you know what? I didn't really like that song. Can't remember what it was about it, right? But I just didn't really enjoy it. I don't think he, we, I stayed there that long. I used to kind of like Netherstone, but I didn't like Shadow Moon Valley. I'm hoping that we hit level 60 sometime in Zanga, in the Grand. I'm hoping. 
We'll find out soon enough, I guess, because we've only we're halfway through this zone. Here we go and hand you in. Greetings. Get some boots. They're probably better than what we got. Probably is the word. I'm not actually sure. Right, we need to sell some stuff. Right, there's a vendor there. Saves so us getting our mounts out. She still don't. That doesn't work very well, that thing. Just going to sell everything. Oh, I sold that staff that I didn't mean to. Doesn't matter though, because, you know, we'll get our own stuff as we're leveling. Right, that's all done. So I think that we had another quest from this lady here, right? Let's get off our bed. And we've got to click on this. There we go. We are going to fly around as a little... A bird. <laughs> Don't know what else to say. It's a bird, isn't it? <laughs> we're going to fly around. And we're going to go and discover some places. Oh. Don't actually know where. Just have a little... Relax as we fly around. Okay. It's just like the structure you described at Umbra Fenley. Does this mean they're not going to pump and water out of all the lakes in Zangamash? I told you. In the dead mire, that's what it looked like it happened. He'd sucked all the water out. Where are we? Royal Fang Reservoir. So that's where the raid was. Three raids there. Blood scale grounds. The Naga are even pumping the water out of their own lake. What purpose could they possibly serve? Could that possibly serve? Maybe they're pumping the water out of this lake. To get in there. I don't know. I think I remember you used to swim down like some middle part, didn't you? And then... There was a, a big lift on the inside. Lots of people died on that lift. And the graveyard, right, used to be all the way somewhere like Telrador and used to have to run all the way back. Can't possibly fit all the water they've been stealing. Where are they keeping it? Are they taking it inside? Serpent Shrine Cavern. Oh, there. Those pipes all appear to be connected to that structure. Oh, yeah. That's it. That thing in the middle there. I missed that first line there. Oh yeah. What more can we see? The, the stealing water to take it underground and who knows why? Who knows why? I've been there as well and I still don't know why. Right, we're flying back anyway and then we can go to... Uh, should we do them two? Eight eels and ten Maya Hydras? Might as well, mate, me. And then we can fly back up to Telrador and finish off there. Lakes of Zangamarsh Explorer. Completed. So we're uh, nearly home. We're nearly at Sanadian Refuge. Okay. Windsinger. What have you got for us? 5,000 experience. We have reached level 50. You know what? We're leveling up really fast this, this episode. You see how Windsinger wants you to use the Iron Vine Seeds on the Steam Pump Controls at the Serpent Lake, Umbrefen Lake, Marshlight Lake, and the Lagoon, then return to it. Okay. So we're going to grab this. We're going to put you there. We're going to go and spend a talent point over on this side. So we have got... Strength of Conviction. While in your consecration, your shield of righteousness and word of glory have 10% increased damage. Judgment of Light. Judgment causes the next five successful attacks against the target to heal the attacker. Seal of Might. Mastery increased. Nope. Oh, Mastery. Mastery. And Strength increased by 2%. That could be good. Later on. Holy Power Abilities have 10% chance to make your next Holy Ability free and deal 10% increased damage and healing. Seal of Alacrity. Haste increased by 2% and Judgment cooldown reduced. So this one. Holy power you spend has a 5% chance to cause your Consecration to flare up. Dealing 195 damage. Up to 5 enemies standing in it. Such a light. Your spells have the abilities to... Your spells and abilities have a chance to cause your target to erupt into a blind light dealing 100... Uh, don't know. Don't know. Fate's armor. Do you know what? I like the sound of that Consecration one. That one. Where is it? That one. So we'll take that. Okay. So we've got to go. We've got to... Oh, yeah. There. So we need to go down to all these places. These things, don't we? And use the seeds as well. So let's start off with eels and hydras. Eels and hydras. Our bags are empty. Good. So these are mostly in the water. Right, there's eels, and there's a hydra. So, where are we? Oh, we are actually in the water. <laughs> it's too far away. Right. I never like going in water in games, right? But this one, I don't actually mind. 
I think it works quite well. The controls are pretty similar to being like normal. I, I thought that might make us go faster, but it didn't. Like the hydras look like they're around the edges, so we can just kill these eels in the water. There's loads down the bottom down there. Oh, we need eel fillets. Oh, yeah, it's a collecting quest as well. It's just even worse. Because we might have to go and get some breath a few times. Right, you're gonna. More unidentified plant parts. So, yeah, we've got one out of, one out of eight. That's it. So far. Rubbish. Right, so let's see what our consecration thing does. I mean, they might not live long enough to, for any of this to happen. <laughs> That's my guess. And now it's on cooldown as well, so nothing's going to happen for a while. We need to grab a bunch of them. A bunch of stuff. There we go. Another eel. It's going to take us ages, this quest. I just know it. I know it. It was a bad idea to say, let's do this one before we finish for the day. Because we have still only got two out of eight. Right, we'll kill these two here, and then we'll go up and get some breath, and then we'll go over that side. Here we go. We got both of them together. Let's get our concentration out. Concentration out. Let's see if it does anything to them. It's not actually looking likely right now. One's dead. I need a drop. Both are dead. All right, we got one more eel fillet. We just need another five. Five more. But well, we're going to see. Can we get both of these? There we go. We might as well try and do more than once if we can. Just because. Just because. Okay, he's dead. First one's gone. I was going to say something blew up there, but that was us. Can we get both of these? How many is that? Five out of eight. Five out of eight. It's a big Maya Hydra. Or Maya Hydra. It's too far away. Oh, look at that. We've got some swimming. Dark as sorceress. We don't want to get too close to you. Right, like one of them's dead. But there's another eel behind us. I need to get closer. I know, I know, I know, I know. <laughs> we need to get closer. Right, we wanted to kill all of these and I want to loop them. You know what, it'd be so good if we get all three of them from this one little patch here. How good would that be? And then we just gotta go kill loads of Maya hiders. We got two of them. We got two of them. Right, we need to find more. We just kill one of you while we're here. It's not like we don't need them. Are you further away than I thought, you know? Oh, it's poison on us. Look at it. It just spat at us. <laughs> you dirty little thing. This is, um, these don't die as fast. Maybe it's just because they're bigger, I don't know. Oh, it does, actually. Right, we need to go and find another... Look at us. Dribbling poison around. Gonna come down this side yet. There's two there. Surely, off them two, we should get the last one that we need. It's too far away. Come on, we can't be that far away. There we go. There we go. We might get that third one as well. We are going to, aren't we? It's going to come. It's going to come. There it is. It come right at the end. So we're fighting in this game. It's so loud. Oh, we got the last one. We got the last one. So now we just need to kill another nine more than my hydras. These are on the coast, right? Which might be okay. Apart from we're going to get some of these little stinging beasts. Thingies. Little bee stingers. Ah, oh, the felon. I'm out of range. Ah, oh, the felon again. I didn't mean that. <laughs> hey, come on, you. Die. Right, we're gonna. F oh, we've got a eel. Oh, we could have killed these guys first, but actually, he hasn't seen us though, which is mad. Just seeing something else moving on the left. Oh, the rain drops in the water. That's so cool. It's too far away. 
All right, so we're okay, yeah. Oh, look at that. There's a fishing trainer. We Did we have Outland fishing? If not, we're going to get it. There's Keleth, Ancient of War. We've ran out of your bonuses, I think. Let's just speak to you. How are you? No, I don't want to buy from you. I don't, especially don't want an oversized bobber. But what I do want to do is fishing training. No, it says already no. Okay, we go and kill this one. What's a big hit? 1300 damage from the first attack. He's still poisoning us. Okay, so we need another six of them. I thought that we were mounting up there. Can work. There's six more. There's one. Oh, I didn't mean to get the eel. I mean, eels look kind of cool, don't they? Oh, and they're biting you, though. And electrocuting you and shit. Okay, go on. See you later. Right. Five more. Five more. There's one. And we might as well do them seeds. Oh, we're out as well. What are we on? An hour and 20 minutes. What's that one? Little pool of, what are they? Spore fish? Oh, it doesn't come to us. It doesn't come to us. See ya. Oh, we got some... Oh, they're well better. What are they? Wrists? Braces? We'll take them. And we'll put them on. And we'll fly away. To that one there. And then after this one, we just need two more. I don't want them two wheels to see us. Don't want them two wheels to see us. Just extra stuff to fight. It's just when time's getting a bit low, you know. I need a target. That one. Well. Oh no, just jaggle clam meat. Jackal clam meat. Oh, we did. We got them both. We got them both. How did the eel see us from underwater? Right, that's that one dead. And then that one over there is going to be our last, final one. This little eel doesn't want to die. We got some gloves, not that we want them. Right, we might have to go and buy some bigger bags at some point, you know. So this is that, and then we've just got to do the seeds, which is going to be a bit of a pain because we're going to have to fight some more of them Naga. Naga? Naga? Right, that's done. So we've got to go all the way to the south. We've got to go that one there, then that one, then that one. And maybe that one, I don't know. I think there's four of them. No, so, yeah, there's four, there's four. So that's that one. Right, let's see if we can do this without fighting loads of people. Uh. <laughs> oh, you hit us while we were in the sky. No, we've got to do it there by the controller. Right, so let's see. We can just drop down there, kill you. See if we can get across without fighting all your mates. We've got to kill the pump overseer. There's a seed. There's a little uh, elemental there. Uh, there's another overseer. Well, he didn't like us doing that, did he? Right, he's dead anyway. Let's see if we can take off this time. And we'll go and get the next one, which is there. Oh, what am I pressing? <laughs> Not number two. That's where we're going. Going to... I forgot what that place is called. The Lagoon. Going to the lagoon controls. Is that, is that the mushrooms making that noise? There's the little control panel. We'll drop on your head. We'll kill you. 
I reckon we can probably avoid that guy, you know, if we just do this and run straight away. No, I don't know. He came pretty quick, didn't he? He did come kind of fast. Let's get a little bit of health. Heal. Uh, oh, the drain schematics. Search Serpently. Oh. <laughs> Search Serpently for signs of a drain. Where's Serpently? Oh. That's okay. That's okay. We're going to go there anyway. I don't like the way I have a rat doesn't kill him. <laughs> kind of feels like it should. Okay, next up is that one there. Balance must be preserved. We've discovered the lagoon. I wonder if we've got to go down there to find that or if we can just fly over it. Don't know. Let's just fly over it and have a look. But you know what? It's going to be that easy anyway. All we got to do is go in the water. <laughs> There's nothing down there. Well, I say it's not down there. There is. But... Right. Are we ready? Serpent Lake discovered. Let's go. 20 yards. Oh, we've done it. We've done it. We've done it. We completed it. Right, go and do the seeds. I'm wondering if we got to do that one as well. I mean, it kind of seems like we should, but there's no water there anyway, so is there any point? That says marsh light. Lee. Must be one of these, and serpent something like. But we haven't discovered one of the lakes. Right, we kill this overseer anyway. Oh, he stunned us. We'll stun you back. And you're dead. Right, let's do this seed. Oh, we actually did escape. We actually did escape. I was wondering if we could. Right, where's the other one? Oh, that's miles away. Miles away, we're not going to do that one today. We'll do that next time because we we're not ready to go that far over yet because we've got to do this part here, black sting, gotta do that, I don't know whether they're in this zone or the next one, but let's go and hand all these in, we've been going long enough anyway, Blessings upon you. Umbra Fem, eel fillets, uh, too many mouths to feed, 8 diaphanous wings from any of the firefly species, okay, we gotta go and kill them bees now, May your days be long. And Five your parched hydras. Okay, so we're going back over that way. So yeah, this does seem like a good place Arcanine for us to end anyway. Battles. Right, we got a, a waste item, which is actually okay. Is that all the quests here handed in? Right, so we got to kill them bee things. We've got to go do that, and we've got to go back to Cenarian Refuge. So this is where we are going to finish off. Everyone, thank you so much for watching. It really does mean a lot. Hope you are enjoying the series so far. If you're new to the channel, if you are enjoying it, please hit that subscribe button. If you enjoyed the episode, hit the thumbs up and drop some comments down below. Let us know what you think. I want to say a massive thank you to all the people who signed up on the Patreon and joined as members. It really does mean a lot. Thank you so much. And we do have a Discord server. If anyone is interested, the link is down below. Come and join us. See you later. Thanks, everyone. Bye.